All right, Coast Life, we've got the holiday weekend, maybe worked in somewhere mm -hmm. this week, maybe took a couple extra days to kind of bookend yourself and uh, because it falls on a Thursday. So yeah. maybe it took Wednesday, maybe it took Friday. Good Just for you. Give yourself one long weekend. Mm -hmm. But uh, we've got one great, great debate. I was behind you on that's that. Okay. Sorry. That's all right. I didn't really cue you up that well. <laughs> no, it's okay. I should have known better. <laughs> that's okay. I'll be ready next time. Um, but yes, today's great debate is 4th of July themed. We are talking the ultimate 4th of July cookout foods. This is a good one. I'm excited. This is a good one. And I think even with all the amazing options that we had on the table, mm -hmm. it's the classics that never go out of style. That's what I'm thinking too. Should we read the options you guys have? Let's give you the options okay. because this was sort of a multiple choice great debate, mm -hmm. which we don't do very often, no. but every now and then, I can't remember what the last one was that we did that really caused a bit of a stir. But yeah. I can't, oh, it was your favorite French fry dip. That's what it was. Ooh, that and one. People had opinions. Strong opinions. <laughs> uh, so your options for ultimate 4th of July cookout food, hot dogs, uh -huh. burgers, yep. wings, yep. ribs, yep. crabs. All winners. What? How do we pick? That's kind of, I want the other option that's like D, all of the above. Right, yeah, but that's, you know, the great debate is it's cutthroat, it's hardcore. Mm -hmm. We don't it give is. you that option. We don't. So you have to pick, Leah. What are you doing? Again, I think I'm gonna stick with the classics. It's tough because crabs mm -hmm. is really, that's a winner, but I don't know that I wanna work that hard. Yeah, on I get the 4th that. of July. I get that. So I'm going hot dogs. I'm going hot dogs too. Yeah, yeah girl. <laughs> it's just like you said, it's classic, it's mm -hmm. easy. It's on the grill. You mm -hmm. can have multiple. Mm -hmm. Crabs takes a little more work than I wanna put in on 4th of July. Yep, just on 4th of July, that's right. all. But I mean, I, and it's not even really that much effort, but no. it's, you know, it's always the quest to go get them. Right. You don't wanna be the sibling that draws the short straw. No, no, the, the paper you gotta put out on the, the table. Paper. Yeah, so I mean, I, I'm definitely all, like, don't worry. When I go all in on crabs, I am all in. We're there, for sure. <laughs> but yeah, I think for 4th of July, it's definitely, it's it's the classics. And I kind of feel like burgers and dogs ought to be roped in together. Right, because you're either one or the other or both. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but like if there's a mutual respect. Yes. Mm -hmm. But I feel like they ought to be on the grill at the same time for sure. Fourth of July. But yes. yeah, I think I'm, I'm going hot dogs. All right. Should we see what people on social media said? Let's see what okay. she said. Let's see. I'll go on Instagram. All right. I'm on Facebook. Lovely. Uh, which over there, Donald said, burgers and dogs, no doubt about it. Perfect. Yep. And uh, over here, we have Tori saying, crabs. Nice. Which again, we get. We're not mad at you. We no. love you. Yep. Crabs, I would say, is one of my favorite foods. Like, if you ask me which one could you eat the rest of your life, oh, yeah. probably crabs. I guess more so my answer would be if I had to pick one to eliminate from that list, it would be ribs. Me too, which surprised me because wings, as of when I checked my phone, this might change, uh, had zero votes. That is surprising. But I get it. At the same time, it's like wings are delish, but are we eating wings for 4th of July? Mm. Yeah, they feel more like football food, I guess. Cause, like they're also messy. Mm -hmm. They're hot too, so yeah. it's like I, I get that in the summer heat, mm -hmm. that feels a little bit more like your cozy winter food. Yeah, yeah. Ribs for me too is that's a little bit more football season, maybe. Mm -hmm. That's okay. mm -hmm. that's grilling out for something else. Yeah. So. Yeah. Okay. okay, well, there you go. Let us know. Don't forget, always go on coastlife.com slash vote. That's where you can vote in the poll, and yes. you can always go on our social medias. But um, I'm happy to see no one's, like, fighting in yeah. our comments. Yeah. Yeah, we're all mutually respectful of the 4th of July food. Which I like to see, because yeah. it is, I mean, that's it's it's the classic, it and is. so everybody knows how to behave. You can, like, <laughs> play baseball with a hot dog. You can, like, <laughs> go put your feet in the pool with a hot dog. You know yeah. what I mean? You can do it's a true. lot. It's true. It's the ultimate handheld food, yeah. where, like, ribs, crabs, and wings, you all of those, you have to, like, secure your spot. Mm -hmm. You got it. Like, you're hunkering down for the day. The bib on. Yes. Yeah. Like, that's going to occupy your entire... Right space yeah where like fourth of july maybe you got to keep an eye on kids in the pool you got exactly. it like there's other stuff you got to do exactly. sparklers <laughs> so sparklers which don't use if you don't know how to use them <laughs> maybe your sparklers went smoother <laughs> than ours but it's fine uh but good this got me excited for yeah i'm feeling patriotic for this weekend yeah me too yeah. i'm excited are hot dogs in american food that's a question for you i think so okay well then even more reason to go yeah. hot dogs yeah let's All do it right. there you go we, we, right. set, we settled it. <laughs> That's right. Uh, but like we said, you can always chime in uh, on our socials yeah. if you've got more to say about it than just hitting, a, hitting the button over mm -hmm. on coastlife.com slash vote. Yep. Uh, but we've got some more Coast Life to get yes. to when we get back.